Animals smell bad. Some plants smell bad too. Being stinky helps some plants and animals stay alive. Okay, and so now say it with me, stinky. Stinky. Amen. Oh, right. <laughs> yes. All right. Look at me. Ooh. Yeah, I know. Okay. All right. Good. My turn. Stinky furry animals. This animal sprays a stinky liquid when enemies get close, right? Enemies are like bad guys, okay? This animal play dead if enemies get close. It also makes stinky green smell. Slime, slime. Slime. Okay, next. A very stinky plant. The corpse flower stinks. A corpse is a dead body, and this plant smells like one. The plant smell brings flies and beetles near, right? So stinky, 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 right? This one, it smells like a dead body. <gasps> okay? No. This animal shoots a stinky liquid at its animal. Good. I'll read this, this one. Okay. This animal makes stinky liquid to keep other animals away. It also pees on food. It doesn't eat right away. The smell may keep other animals away. Oh my goodness, he pees on his food. Ew, gross. Do you understand? Yeah. My goodness, okay. Oh my God. <laughs> Go ahead. This is like a beast. It's like a water buffalo, right? Yeah. yeah. All right, or yeah. This bite. animal fight over man. It use stinky pee to keep other away. Oh my god! So mates here, mates, mates. That's going to be uh, like boyfriend or girlfriend or paraya or sami. Okay. Okay. All right. Go ahead. Next. All right. Stinky birds. This bird eats leaves. Right. So you see where the bird is standing. Right. You asked me before, what are leaves? Right. What are leaves there? And then those are leaves there, okay? Okay. He's like standing on a few leaves. Tiny yeah. leaves in its body break down the leaves. This way of eating makes it smell bad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. the, this bird is the animal. It's grow up when animals get close. It's throw up smell very bad. Okay. Oh my God. Oh man, look at that. That's a cool picture actually. I like that picture. It's kind of, this bug sprays a hot stinky liquid when enemies get close. The liquid is so hot, it can kill some enemies. Yeah. Wow. No, yeah, no, 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 no. You want to skip this page? Yeah. Okay. No problem. <laughs> All right, other stinky animals. This turtle is also called a stink pot. It smells bad when enemies get close. This frog smells like rotten onions when enemies get close. Rotten onions is like all green and like gross and disgusting. It's like, like this, right? Okay, next. Good and stinky. Some animals smell bad. Some plants smell bad too. Being stinky helps some plants and animals stay alive. Good. Okay. All right. And then boom, done. All right. Go back. Okay. Finish, finish, finish. All right. Let's do the quiz really quickly together. All right. What is the main idea of nature stinks? Furry animals can shoot smelly food at other animals. Some animals smell bad to protect themselves. Being stinky helps some plants and animals stay alive. Correct, good, smart. Okay, go ahead, you can do this one. I'll put some half like kangaroo. Oh, let me help you here. Okay, you can click on it to listen, okay? You can click on it to listen. Click on, yep. And then if you click on that, you can, if you click on the sentence, you can listen to them read it. Uh, Atherty is the smallest animal in the world. 
Mm, that one's a little bit different. It says, an ant eater is the smelliest animal in the world. An ant eater is the smelliest animal in the world. Opossums have pouches like kangaroos, or the stink pot turtle is smelly but cute, right? So do you remember what a fact is? Yeah. Yeah, facts are real things about the world and the universe, right? So for example, we have one sun and our planet goes around the sun every 365.25 days. I think B. B, opossums have pouches like kangaroos. I think you're correct as well. Yeah, good. Fair enough. Why well, did the other white nature thing on? to stay away from a stinky animal and try to tell funny story about people getting burned by to inform the reader about why some pen and animals think. Yeah. To in no, I don't know. A or B. Correct. You are right. A is correct. Trust your heart, right? Keith, your reading is getting better, bro. Right? Your reading is Deacon Mark, dude. It's getting better. Do you feel it? Yeah. Than last year, huh? Uh, oh, what is polycat? Polycat. Okay. Right. If you want to go back to the book, that's good. Or you can use Google too. Oh, smart kid. Oh, impressive, Mark. <laughs> that's good. What I cannot do. Hmm? Oh, polecat. For this one, it's probably going to be better to check a picture. Right, I think it's better to check pic a picture for that one instead of Google Translate. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think it's good to... Yeah. Yeah, for me, I like checking both, right? I like checking translation, and then I like... Or I like checking the translation, and I also... Like, yep, P-O-L. E. Not a police cat, but close. <laughs> P O L E C A T. C A T. Yep, cat. Meow. Okay, good. All right, looking good. Okay, and then you can see that there's a European pole cat there. Right? But it's cute. It's pretty cute. Yeah, definitely. So look at the question on Google, right? It says, people also ask, what's the difference between a skunk and a polecat? And that's actually the same question in your quiz, all right? Same question in your quiz there. Okay, so look this way and this way. Yep, how are so a skull, how are a skunk and a polecat similar? <clears throat> and similar, it means like almost same, same, okay? People also ask what different between skunk and a polecat. Yeah, I know. It's like almost the same question as Raz Kids. That's funny, right? Yeah. Okay, let's go back. To Raz but Kids. I don't know the answer. Let's try. I'll help you, okay? Teamwork. They both make stinky thing. They more or they can only spare once a day. They both rest the tail and payments there. I think C. Yeah, I think it's B or C, right? Let's try. Yeah. Let's C or B. Yeah, I think it's I think it's C because they talked about that in the book. It was mentioned in the book. However, yeah. uh, can only spray once a day. I feel like I read that, right? You too, yeah. right? Yeah. That sounds good. Which word means the same thing as rotten, right? And remember what? Rotten, all right, let's use Google for this. Rotten. Right. And then I want you to type rot, uh, rotten apple or rotten food. R-O-T-T-N, right? R -O -T -T -N, okay. right? Tomatoes, that works too. Uh, no. Okay, let's go to images. Wait, 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 hold on. Okay, rotten food. There you go. And then click on images. There you go. Oh my God, I don't look at rotten food. <laughs> you don't like rotten food. Nobody does, right? What rotten, is this? Rotten food is gross. Oh, uh, it looks like some lady re eating rotten food. Let's, I don't want to watch that at all. That seems terrible. No, no. I don't want that. 
poisoning. That's funny. Okay, all right. Nature stinks here. Okay. So tasty means delicious or sad or out of right? And then fresh, you know what fresh means. So which one do you think rotten means? Spoiled. Huh? Spoiled. Spoiled, correct. You got it. Ding, ding. Okay, all right. Let's check. Done. Nice. Okay. Very nice. Congratulations. Now I want you to repeat after me. Okay. Say my reading skill. My reading skill is getting incredibly better. Getting incredibly better. Yes, I have improved. I'm having trouble. I have improved. I have improved. A lot. A lot. Okay. A lot. A lot. A lot. Like mag mag or yeah, okay. All right, very nice, dude. Good job. Okay, all right. So we're done with the rest kids now. All right, we're done with the rest kids now. 